A good friend of mine sitting next to me had a Walkman. He said, listen to this, passed me the earphones and it was Sweet and Tender Hooligan. And straight after the song, he took the headphones back off me, but I, I was hooked and, and I wanted to find out more about this, this band, this, this noise, which immediately felt very, very, uh, mm -hmm. which spoke to me. And because I enjoyed the Morrissey Live experience so much, I became extremely intrigued by it by what it must have been like to see the Smiths because of course I, ne I never could and, and that's I think uh, the main reason why I decided to, uh, to join uh, this uh, tribute band, the Smiths indeed, uh, to, to, to re recreate that experience for ourselves and to, to get an, a sense of what it must have been like to be at a Smiths uh, concert because if I couldn't be at one then, then, then I, uh, I thought I might as well um, uh, create one. I think the Smiths come from an era where, where being in a band and being an independent artist as well, uh, being in a rock group, still, still really massive and still really connected with people more so than these days. I, I don't, perhaps I'm getting old, but I don't feel like current bands or even bands in the, in the, the 90s or the noughties were, 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 were still really mattered as much as the, as the bands from, from earlier days did. And the Smiths were, were, were very much themselves. They had a very, very uh, gang-like mentality, which people who, who, who jumped on board immediately got and ran with and continue to run with and fans, new fans today still feel those vibrations I think and, and, and they, they want to be part of that gang. Monitoring is fine, perhaps up a little bit. When I first started doing this, I, I thought it was enough just to have a voice which sounded similar. Uh, and then the rest would follow. Uh, but in actual fact, I already had years and years of bedroom practice you know, in front of a mirror, just singing the songs aloud. And, and when you sing them aloud and when you move, when you stand up, you, 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 you immediately start to make certain gestures. But then, after a couple of gigs, you do find yourself quite naturally uh, just extending your arms out a bit further or, or, or just, just doing certain things which, which uh, the song suggests. <laughs> 